Purdue football's first home game is set for September 11th against Western Illinois. Last year, the Boilermakers' seven home games generated $14 million for the local economy. Joe LePage shows us what the university is doing to build on that amount this year. Football fans are counting down the days to pigskin season. No doubt Boiler backers are looking for their team to take to the air and ground against the likes of Ohio State and Notre Dame. The university and the cities of Lafayette and West Lafayette are taking steps to make sure even the casual fan will have a reason to buy a ticket. It's about trying to offer that personalized opportunity. If I could walk to every house in Lafayette and knock on their door, I'd do it. Purdue Athletic Director Morgan Burke says the university is bridging the gap between the school and the public. That effort to work together is playing out quite literally. The Friday before every home game, the public will be able to interact with the team during the Boiler Bridge Walk. The bridge is a perfect spot. I mean, that was, uh, I don't know who came up with the idea. I, it wasn't me, but I like it. I mean, it's simple. Burke says it's easy to pack the house when a team wins 11 games on a consistent basis, but he says the capacity crowd at Ross Aid Stadium actually improves the product on the field, and that means it's more wins for the Boilers. I mean, I don't think there's any doubt that the home field advantage is a huge, huge deal. And, you know, it sends a signal when you're recruiting. If you've got a stadium, it's full. Um, it makes a big deal. Purdue President France Cordova says a win on the field is a victory for the whole student body. They want to bond with the university, have meaningful uh, activities outside the classroom that bring them more friends, more social activities, more feeling really good about their school and really proud of it. Cordova says if the public buys in, it's a touchdown for the entire community. Joe LePage, News Channel 18. 2010 will be a year of firsts on campus. The biggest change will be the Boiler Bridge Walk across the Myers Pedestrian Bridge. This new tradition is set for the Friday before every home game. The university is also teaming up with 11 area banks and 30 other organizations to help give the public easier access to game day tickets and ticket specials for the September 11th home game against Western Illinois. Tickets are $20, and every ticket the fans buy will be matched by the athletic office and given to a member of the military.